Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how to use Adobe Bridge to organize photos. So, if you have ever dealt with missing files and duplicate photos or how was spent on spending searching for the right image, you know how frustrating it can be to manage a growing photo library. Without a system like Adobe Bridge, it's easy to waste time and lose track of your best work. So, for those who don't know what Adobe Bridge does, so Adobe Bridge is a digital asset management tool that allows you to view, organize, and manage your photos in one place with features like metadata, tagging, batch processing, and small collection. So Adobe Bridge makes organizing your photos very effortlessly. So how you can do this? So simply just go to Google here and search for Adobe Bridge. Let me show you. Click on this first link. And as you can see here, Adobe Bridge is free. So let's just go and click on download app. And here it will ask us to log in into the account and as you can see here downloading has been started so let's go and click on it and this is the entire dashboard which will look like so we have to enter our system password so click on continue and click on yes now it will load for a few seconds i will use my google account you can use or create a new account to log in into your adobe so as you know, Adobe use uh, only, if you're using Adobe products, then you can just use only one ID to log in into any of the Adobe product here. Now I think we are into the Adobe Creative Cloud. Now it will ask you to install Creative Cloud and Bridge. Now this is really important, so make sure just go and click on Start Installing. It will take a very few seconds. Now you can just skip this questions, uh, not necessary here. Now, while installing this up, right, you can select a photo and open the metadata panel to view details like camera settings and file size. Now, basically, this is how it looked the entire dashboard here. You can access all your photos, right? You can even add keywords by clicking on the keyword panel and type relevant, you know, tags, wedding, portrait, right? So you can organize your photos. And this is only useful who have a large collection or large library of photos such as photographers or some organizations here use smart collection to automatically grow photos based on criteria like rating keyword or file type so this is how you can do so now if you want to a batch renaming and exporting files you can also do that from adobe bridge now that is really useful feature because it helps you to select multiple photos and go to tool section batch rename and define a naming convention example event name underscore data underscore zero zero one and apply to all selected files right so this is how you can do so and thanks for watching this video